Yes, it looks great. Yeah. Good morning, everyone. Thank you for joining us today. Uh, my name is Adnan Tweet. I'm an AI engineer at OpenDevin. I am, uh, and I am with, here with my colleague. Uh, hello, everyone. I'm Hassan Mansour, and I work with OpenDevin as technology and innovation manager. And today we will be presenting our work on the developing a knowledge SDK to streamline uh, literature literature searching uh, using OpenAlex. <clears throat> so firstly, who are we? OpenDevit is a consultancy incorporated in 2014. It's composed by a multinational team that believe in the, in the power of education. We have conducted projects across Sub-Saharan Africa, the Middle East, Europe, and North America. We have demonstrated experience of approaches to enhance teaching and learning in low and middle income countries. We are a leading organization for teacher professional development in Sub-Saharan Africa. Equity, evidence, and accessibility are the heart of our approach, and we seek to support and build local capacity wherever possible in our implementation and research, drawing on technology where it offers the best value proposition. Thank you, Adnan. So I will take it from here. So why did we build a software development kit? So we had a main challenges, which are like uh, working with a large data set, since one of the primary challenges um, working and working for literature review is managing a vast amount of data that is going to be retrieved from the API. So this is one of the main crucial reasons why we decided to build an SDK. Another reason is for like an error management, since it's like essential to deal with like rate limitations, uh, server errors, or time out. And lastly, is to navigate complex API queries, since construction and managing complex API queries can be a challenging, especially with a lot of filters and another options as well. Um, API can can be difficult to work on, especially for non very techy people. So it was one of the main challenges. And for our case studies that titles uh, meta analysis and systematic review and the standard quality characteristic of a tech hub innovation uh, innovation implementation for disadvantaged students. Um, we are in collaboration with the uh, EEF. Uh, Education Endowment Foundation is a leading organization dedicated for promoting evidence-based educational innovation. Uh, we are conducting a comprehensive meta-analysis and systematic review. This research seeks to gain insight into quality, uh, characteristic, and implementation of educational technology uh, innovations for disadvantaged students. So a quick uh, open Alex uh, SDK uh, overview. So we will start with what in SDK. SDK is a software development kit, is a collection of tools, libraries, and documentation that's help developers to create a software applications. It simplifies the development process by providing pre-built components and easy to follow guides. Um, the enhanced integration, the Open Alex SDK simplified the process working with Open Alex API using Node.js or TypeScript, making it more accessible and more efficient for developers and researchers. Uh, for the accessibility, it's an open source project. You can find it on uh, OpenDavid slash uh, Open Alex SDK. I would provide the link in the chat. Um, and for the core functionality, the SDK provide uh, a client model that handle all of the API communication, making it like straightforward to perform searches and retrieve data and saving it as well. The currently it support full endpoints for work, author sources, and institutional topics with future plans to add support for publishers and funders and concepts. Additionally, the SDK provides some features that are not available in the API, such as the ability to like save the data in chunks and download the entire search uh, results. 
Um, also, like you provide the snowballing as well. You can do a snowballing. You can give it one search. It will extract all of the, um, or all of the publication are related to it. That will like make it more usable and more flexible. So I'm going to do like a live demo, like quick live demo for the tool. So let me just share my screen. Um, can you see my screen? Yes, <clears throat> yes uh, we can. Yeah, thank you. So um, a qu to quick install uh, Open Alexis DK or what you need to just like run the following command, npm install Open Alex dash SDK. And it will be uh, ready to add it to your project. So you can initiate a new instance of on Open Alex. If you have an email and the API key, you can provide it. If not, it's not necessary, right? So if you want to extract a, sim, a single work, you can just use the endpoint work um, and provide the ID and it will be extracted. And let me just show you an example of the output really quickly. As you can see, it's the same output as the one from the API. So let me uncomment the code. Um, you can also use external ID. Um, you can find all of the options. We try to add all of the types from the API key so you don't have to go forward and backwards between the, the documentation. Um, for example, the UI for this one. And if you wanna like extract um, a number of works, um, if you wanna extract a number of works, um, those are all of the possible options in the option, you can specify the search. The search field are limited to five options as the in the API. For the filters, we included every possible uh, filter in the API. You can just like, for example, has, and this will auto complete the option. And it's also like um, match with the type as well. So if there isn't any note or anything, it will like tell you like, um, for example, if you like entered, um, entered like a, an author word and you enter like, for example, a, a string in it, it will say, it would show us an error because it's only accept a number. And that, and the demo, one second, let me just go back to the presentation. You're only, you're also right. about one minute. Ah, okay, okay, I'll, I'll try to be quick. Um, the benefit of utilizing the SDK for the EF a literature review is like to improve the uh, accuracy and relevance. It's like time and resource efficient. It's give us a real time updates because um, the researchers can just rerun the query, uh, the code again, and they will get the same results. And we also like added created like a CLI based on the SDK to make it even more easier for researchers to interact with Open Alex. Uh, further possibilities. Um, so creating uh, institutional repositories or education evidence. We create a specialized tool that create um, evidence library collecting uh, for data like relating to like C sustainable development goals. It's live and you can access from the link. I will provide in the chat after the meet, uh, after its end. And also it can provide like automated uh, literature review uh, systems. We uh, do integration with uh, OpenAI uh, open tools to do automated screen. And it's shown like a amazing, uh, amazing results so far, um, but it's out of the scope of the literature review so far. So I just wanna say thank you and sorry for taking so much time. I hope um, to explore our repository and feel free to contribute or point for any like features you wanna add, or like if you had any uh, issues, we will be more than happy to fix it. And please share your thoughts and ideas with us. Here is our website our name on uh, LinkedIn, and this is our Twitter. And feel free to scan the QR code for the links. Thank you.